This is a quick video to show you the new auditing features of Morphit 8.1. In this binder I have a single data table with three data elements in it. On the left I have some instructions. I've got one which switches on requiring for the reason for change and the second one that stops it. These can be integrated within instructions in the binder. So for example, when I've captured the initial data for my assay and have uploaded them, I can switch on the reasons for change during the binder. So I'll put on the reasons for change now. Now I'm going to change my data in the table. If I refresh the audit trail underneath, you can see the data records that show the data has been changed after I've entered reason for change mode. If I select an individual reason, press the button, I can provide a reason for change which is sourced from the audit trail reasons. So I'm going to select in this case a data correction and press OK. I can also multi-select rows and press the same button. Again, if I want to, I can select a reason from the list and also add a miscellaneous comment. that will apply that reason to all of the, the uh, audit changes. If I make further changes, again the audit record will show up. If I try and save the binder with those audit reasons un unprovided, it won't let me save it. It also won't let me export or print from the uh, application or upload to BioRails. Again, I will select the changes and provide a reason. Now I can save the binder without problems. And that completes this video.